Are you serious? Are you serious? Well, get some coffee and calm down and get real serious. Tonight, I'm going to reveal the X-Files. I have been given this file. I was paid a visit yesterday by a government insider who has given me some very, very, very informative information, especially for those involved in alternative media. And um, uh, I don't want you to freak out or anything, but um, this government insider um, showed me his credentials, showed me his badge, showed me his... Um, well, he had several forms of identification, but I looked right at his, his credentials. And he wasn't playing, but he was very, very kind. He gave me some key information. I'm not going to reveal the source at all. But I am going to share with you, especially those of you who are involved in alternative media. There is certain things they're doing. We all know we've, hey, the Hagmans have been hacked. BP Earthwatch has been hacked. The Hagmans had their apartment raided, robbed, turned everything upside down. Um, Dabo, uh, somebody crashed into his car. I was crashed into last week. I had That was after having my entire laptop completely scrambled with something that was not a virus, it, you know, like you would get from some hackers. Oh, no. No, and then and so there's some things going on out there uh, in the real world. I'm going to read to you this little paragraph um, from the file. It's quite lengthy, and I'll share information from the file tonight on Sunday Night Live. But here's the paragraph, um, Pastor Paul. This caused a stir this week when I saw there was an article out on the internet. I went out and found you some related open source information. Um, please understand this information cannot be validated or confirmed as truthful by the government per se. But the bottom line is this. Many of those these tools are being used against government monitored alternative media personalities. The tools listed below are just a very small sample of the suspected and potential available, excuse me, suspected and potential capacities of this agency. I just wanted to give you a heads up of the capabilities and that are supposedly available and being used to monitor, manipulate, and control persons deemed as potential problems to the government and their agenda. Now, of course, we all know this kind of stuff should only be in Hollywood, right? He's kind of being uh, facetious here. And, uh, but uh, those who try to keep the masses stirred up in some form or another, nevertheless, I have provided some light reading for your entertainment only. Okay, so he's a, bit, he's a little uh, facetious. But he goes on to tell us a little bit about this agency called TAO. I'll tell you more about TAO. And there, of course, they work with a lot of different three-letter agencies in, in the federal government. And I will share with you the types of tools they are using to monitor people like myself and others. Of course, some of you know that I was visited by a member of the NSA. Let me know that I was one of 20 that were being monitored closely now, not only because of what we say, but they want to know how in the world we know what we know. And uh, my answer to the NSA agent was, I don't have a, a, anybody on the inside that's going to give me special information. I get my information from the Lord. I, I'm just reading what's going on in the general public. I know then I compare what that is from the biblical perspective, and then through the Holy Spirit, we get revelation knowledge. Um, so... I'll share with you a little bit tonight from this X-File, we'll call it, um, and we'll tell you a little bit about the TAO. I'll tell, with you, tell you what kinds of tools they're using. We'll talk about 
quantum insert. We'll talk about Fox Acid. We'll talk about several of these other key things that they're doing and using to not just only... Look, everybody knows what we talk about because we put it on YouTube every day. The alternative media guys uh, like myself, you know, you know who we are, you know where we live, and you know what we talk about. They want to know how we know. I'll be back tonight. Don't miss tonight. Sunday Night Live starts at 7 p.m. Eastern. That's right, 7 p.m. Eastern. You don't want to be late for this broadcast. We'll be live at my website at www.paulbegleyprophecy.com as well as uh, new live stream, Roku Satellite Television, Blog Talk Radio, your cell phones and iPhones if you have the Paul Begley Prophecy app, and right here on this YouTube channel. I'll see you tonight. Give your life to Jesus Christ. We are living in the last days, and we have the victory in Jesus' name.